we've got roughly about 80 to 90 superhumans that have come and joined our Adapt or Die program today, which is uh, super cool and super excited about it. I've been pumped for this. Um, it's the signature event of the year, but also um, it's about like how we're gonna like get the year started, how we're gonna preload it with some couple of ideas that will get the needle moving because literally there's gonna be four things that you're gonna be doing. We're gonna be like activating something and then taking it all the way from calibrate, accelerate, and into the bit what we call celebrate and moving that needle. So we've got a couple of great speakers, Matt Shalhoub from Under the Hammer, telling us a little bit about what's happening out there in the marketplace from the trenches. I don't know about you, but generally there's like one or two anchors in your life and these guys are gonna to commit to letting two or one of those anchors go for 2019. And they're gonna put it up there and like, like, this is what I'm letting go of. So we're gonna get into the room, we're gonna get started. So I'll check you on the other side of uh, the lens, I suppose. See you soon. Woo! Who's having fun today? That was one of the rules, right? To have fun. Uh, laziness, negative people. Um, someone said, I'm gonna let go of the past. Awesome. Letting go of dogs. Cool, I like that. <laughs> so I really appreciate you guys of what you're gonna let go of going into 2019. I don't I think we all know the why. Yeah, we all know the why of the Royal Commission, we all know about the banking and all that kind of stuff, yeah? Is there anything that we as individual agents can do about that? No. What can we control? How are we at? How are we at and what we do. What we're going to do, we're going to be focusing on two things. I want to look at where we've actually come from this year and what's actually happened. And I'm going to ask you guys to sort of share with me what your experiences are. And I think what you will find across the board is that your experiences, no matter what marketplace you're working in, are not dissimilar to anyone else. Would, it, would that be fair to say? Yeah. All right. Steve. Tell me, what did you get out of Matt's session? Delay the launch. Delay the launch, nice. George, what did you get? Adjusting your mindset. It's gonna be hanging around for lunch. So if you've got any questions, you know, hit him up at lunchtime. Uh, he's, he's like a walking Wikipedia in terms of auctions and pricing, because that, that was to me like revolutionary. Give Matt one more love, three, two, one. Okay, beautiful. So you basically right now need to think of this. You need to think about four projects going into 2019, Okay, that you're gonna hone in on. Be it vendor management, be it prospecting. I'm gonna be seeing you and I'm gonna be asking you what are your four projects? And then I'm gonna be asking you after 30 days, how are we going? How will you celebrate once you've crushed the BDA, once you've crushed prospecting, Will? How will you celebrate, Dan, when you've got four liftings that you've gone out there and lifted? Like this lady said, I wanna go and buy a Chanel handbag. I said, beautiful, whatever floats your boat. You know what I mean? Like whatever it is for you that's gonna be for you to honour, acknowledge this project that you've actually done. And I want everyone in this room to grow. It's pretty cool. I think he's like a really down to earth person. I think he really cares. The accountability, working through your business plan, week in, week out, the daily, just being there for you daily to be able to check in with. What I love about Patty is that I can call him anytime he answers the phone. And he's really supportive. He's just not another coach. He actually really gets involved in your business. He's got so much knowledge. Um, he's very informative and he's always there for you when you need him. I'm really grateful for his time and for the expertise and uh, making us not only better, better agents, but making us better people. And that's what I love about him. Really genuine, humble, respectful guy. Yeah. That he brought us together. He brought us together. <laughs> really helped me grow my business uh, in that time with double down numbers year on year. But I also love that Claudio um, tailors what he finds out what I need and then he just tailors it to that. Uh, his uh, advice is second to none. I think Claudio is the guru of real estate coaches. It's just like really broadening my horizons and giving me a holistic approach that I didn't expect to have, so it's been great. OMG, today has been absolutely epic. We had so much fun. I, I told the guys when we started today, 
there's some rules. We need to have loads of fun. Number two is they had to get engaged into the process today, um, which was mean interacting. And one of the things that we actually did was um, we got them to let go of an anchor. Um, and I'm just gonna share some, we didn't put names on it, but they actually had to let go of an anchor. And one of them was like sadness and anger. The other one was let go high maintenance clients. Um, what about this one? Some guy wrote self doubt chow. Self limiting beliefs, let those anchors go. Um, these guys are now walking away with an implementation program for 2019 that they're gonna hone in on. So one thing is you do the work, but the next thing is you actually gotta implement. For me, I'm gonna make sure that I commit to get 50 agents to that level. So they're excited, they're pumped. I'm super excited and pumped about my goal and their goals for 2019. And as we wrap up this vlog, I don't know when you're gonna be watching this, if you've had a Christmas, great. If you haven't, I would love to wish you a Merry Christmas and I hope you can go out there and crush 2019 like these guys. Talk to you next year, guys.